What up fam? On today's episode, we're gonna learn how to make this working feather quill pen. Stay tuned. For this project, I'm using this turkey feather I found in my yard. First things first, I need to make some room to hold on to this pen. To do that, I cut away some of the feathers down at the bottom. Happy with the way that looks, I'm now gonna leave the end of the feather in water overnight. This is gonna help keep the pen supple and stop it from breaking from being too brittle. Next, you're gonna need a container full of play sand that's been heated to about 350 degrees. Then remove your feather from the water and stick the writing end into the sand. To heat my sand up to this temperature, I just put it in the oven at 350 degrees for about 15 minutes. Now you're gonna to wanna to leave your feather in the sand until it completely cools, or about two hours. This tempering process helps to harden the quill, making it last longer. Once cool to the touch, hold the pen in your hand as if you're going to be writing to assess where you need to make your next cuts. Now cut out a 45 degree angle on the side that would be facing down towards your paper. Then, positioning your cut side up, Hold the feather flat against the table and use a sharp knife to split your nib to the end. Finally, go back in and refine the tip of your pen. You can try playing with different shapes and sizes as each different shape will behave differently when you write on paper, causing some lines to be thicker or thinner or whatever. And fam, I am pleasantly surprised at how well this thing writes. For just being cut out of a feather, it's really smooth. And that's it. Now you can put your thoughts to paper just like your forebearers did. So go forth, my skill monkeys, and spread the good word of the tree. And as always, keep leveling up, you.